name is Lauren, I am an Advocare distributor and I wanted to try out the 24 day challenge for the second time. I did it back in January and if you're interested in seeing that video, I'll put it down below in the description box. During the 24 day challenge this time, I lost 9 pounds of body fat. Oh my goodness, whenever I stepped on the scale this morning, I was so shocked. I did not think I was going to have lost 9 pounds. I just cannot believe I lost 9. I'm so proud of myself. I really was so strict this challenge. This is 5 pounds of body fat. Basically, since I almost lost 10 pounds, I lost 2 of these off of my body. To lose weight slowly is better than to lose it all at one time. So if you lose 5 pounds, be proud of yourself because look at this. I cannot believe if I would have lost 5 pounds, I would have been like, heck yeah, goodbye. Really quickly, if you are interested in the 24 day challenge and you don't even know what it is, you have never heard of it, you, you have so many questions and you just need some guidance, please feel free to email me. I'll put my email down below. I'll also put the link to my page if you want to go browse and kind of read on what the 24 day challenge is. I love the 24 day challenge and I cannot wait to show you my journey. Today is day one of the 24 day challenge. Cannot wait to see my results in 24 days because I'm taking this a lot more seriously than I did the first time around. I literally have not ate a single bad thing, which is really hard for me because I love candy and I actually have candy in my house right now and I will not let myself even take one sour gummy worm. I will not do it. I'm not cheating myself, I want the best results this time around, so. I just finished with week one, I'm starting week two tomorrow. Week one I lost six pounds and I ate super healthy, so let's see how week two is. It's day 9. I am so ready for day 10 because I'm tired of drinking this fiber water every morning. It's really not bad, but I'm just like ready to get to the second part of the challenge because that's my favorite part. It is day 10 and I knew I was feeling results already. I knew I lost a little bit of pounds, but I just took a picture like I did on day 1 and the picture difference is crazy just in 10 days. So Seeing the difference in my back already makes me so much more motivated to finish the next 14 days. I cannot wait to see the outcome. I've been being, being so strict and I just, ah, I'm so excited. I just had to share that with y'all. Also, cheers to the last day of the fiber drink. I'm so excited. Oh, not my favorite. It is day 14. I have been loving the challenge so far. This weekend I did have to eat out at a restaurant, which I didn't want to do, but I got a chicken sandwich, so. But I'm really feeling different. I just cannot wait to see day 24. I have not had canes in like 15 days, literally. I had it the day before I started my challenge because I'm addicted to it, but I haven't even been craving it, so I'm, I'm excited about that. It's day 18. I just got back from New Orleans and I'm kind of mad at myself because I had to eat a turkey burger from a restaurant and I didn't want to eat at a restaurant. So I'm kind of feeling eh about it. Hopefully it doesn't do any damage. Three days left. I really haven't had a cheap meal this entire 20 one days and yeah I definitely feel so much better than whenever I started the challenge and I'm excited about that hey I only have two days left I'm so excited to see the end result it's day 23 I figured I would save y'all the um the look right now because I woke up feeling super sick because I have a throat ache and I just my eyes are puffy and it's just oh but anyways I just took a picture to compare from day one to day 23 and it's crazy I'm so excited I got results but I'm not done yet 
I have one day left and I'm not gonna give up now. I realized how stupid that sunglass thing was. It is day 25 for me and I am so ready to keep going and get more results. If you are really just at a plateau, you just can't lose those pounds that you're trying to get off, this is the perfect thing to do. The main thing to focus on if you want to do the challenge is nutrition. If you are not eating clean, you might get results, but you just have to be really strict with eating clean. I literally ate so much this challenge i don't know how i lost nine pounds it blows my mind because i was constantly snacking because i was so hungry because i'm assuming my metabolism just went through the roof because before this challenge i definitely had canes once a week and i haven't had canes in 25 days and i literally don't even want it right now but before the challenge i was very lazy i didn't have any energy i had no motivation i just felt disgusting i had let myself get to a place i never wanted to go i was at my heaviest weight and after the challenge i am nine pounds lighter i have so much energy it's crazy and i want to take you on that journey with me so if you have any questions please feel free to email me if you do the challenge and you only lose five pounds do not be discouraged because look this is what you lost this is a lot of body fat and i seeing this and holding this big glob of fat makes me feel so good so after seeing my 24 day journey the main thing you need to remember is that the 24 day challenge is not a quick fix it is a jump start to a healthy lifestyle last time i did the challenge i just stopped taking products after because i was so busy but this time my good friend mallory told me the three main things that i should stick to and i'm going to be doing these daily i am so excited i love my spark i love my meal placement shakes and i love my slim the main thing about Avocare that I love so much in my team is that there is so much support. You are not alone through this journey. If you do it alone, it's just going to be, it's not going to be as motivating. If you have a group of people that are like, heck yeah, girl, you keep going, you do it. How's day 10? How's day 11? It's going to feel so much better and you're going to be so proud of yourself. I absolutely love my Advo fam. They are awesome. They support me. Thank you so much for watching. If you are interested in the challenge and you don't have anybody to buy it from, please feel free to go to my link down below. Email me. I want to talk to you. I want to help you. I feel so good after this challenge and I want you to feel the same way about yourself. Thank you so much for watching.